true. Very exciting day today. So, as you know, Ava's crawling everywhere. excited today because I got a new toy and I have the robot vacuum the iRobot vacuum which I love because it picks up everything but Mommy, I oh, yeah, got the mop now. Jace you it's gonna help me? Toy. Yeah. Get the mop. Time to the mop. Open it and stop. Oh. I don't like Okay so it looks mop. like in our box we have the actual mop. Really fancy. It's packaged really nicely here. It's like the charging station. Directions. And then, let's see what's in here. Okay, we have the cord, the cable cord. And it looks like it comes with some pads. Okay, so, so I'm really excited because our floors kind of stay dirty. There's 10 people in our house, lots of traffic. Jay's here, not always the cleanest, sometimes makes a mess. So we're going to see how this mop works in our house. Super excited. It did come with a few um, Swiffer, Swiffer and wet mops. So this looks like a single use dry sweeper. You get two. This is a single use wet. You get two. And then this is a wet washable one. I'm going to wash you. This is a wet washable one so I guess once you use it you can throw it in the washer, wash it and put it back on. So they have that. And then this is a um, cleaning solution. It says it's safe for hardwood floors, all hardwood floors that are sealed. So this is like a sample bottle they had put in the box. It says use half of it and then um, the other half at another time. You can buy the full size and there's directions on how much to use for a full size bottle. Okay, so on this mop, it actually sprays water. So the lid opens, has a little reservoir. You lift it and you pull it out. You can unscrew it and that's where you fill it. So this is where you would put like your solution. You put half of the bottle in and then fill the rest up with water. Then it just sets back in. And close it. Pop down. Okay, so this is the wet washable one. You can mop. On the back there's like a, a blue square. What this blue square for is so you can attach it to the mop. So you flip it over. It has some little grooves. You just get it lined up in these grooves and it just slides right on. Now it stays, mops. Now when you're done, it doesn't just pull off. There's a button on the front right here. You're gonna push this button, it detaches it, and it comes right off. Okay, same for the, same for the, this is just a Swiffer dry mop. Hey, Bob. This is just a dry mop, same thing, has a white bag. So that's pretty cool. What you think? Thank you. Better. You think it's better? Okay, so I did have the iRobot Bravo before. This was just the basic Swiffer. You could attach um, the wet pad on the bottom and it would mop. So my old one, my iRobot, was not a smart robot. Like I couldn't hook it to my phone, couldn't send it to a certain room to mop, I couldn't um, make boundaries for it. I just could press go and it went. The new one hooks to my phone, make boundaries for it. I can tell if there's carpet in this room or if it needs to double duty up on a certain area because it's really dirty. So I'm really going to like that. So this one also did not come with a sprayer. So this one just had the Swiffer mop or a wet mop. You just hooked it to the bottom and that was it. And as you can see how dirty our floors get from everybody in this house or traffic. So I really needed the Smart mop so I could send them out. He actually sprays, he goes around, and he works with my iRobot S9 um, together. So I can send out my vacuum to vacuum, and then when he's done vacuuming, my mop goes out and then mops.
came off is red. So I got to looking and it sent me an alert and it said my, my mop is stuck on a cliff. <laughs> and I was wondering where is this cliff in my house? And here's the cliff. So I think maybe it's confused or um, I'm gonna have to look into this one. So I've had my robot for a while now and I absolutely love him. He does take a little while to learn the area. There's a um, section called mapping. You can send him out to map your floor. As far as the cliff he got stuck on, well, it was a, a tile and my floor is a little bit higher than the rest of it. So it does take a little bit of learning for him. He did learn it and he is mopping like a champ now. If you haven't got one yet, I highly recommend one. Totally saves tons of time. You can set him with your other robot. He sends out the vacuum. Then my Brava heads out and he mops behind him. Total lifesaver. Haven't checked it out. Check it out. Get you one. And thank me later.